What's up, Hope Kids? Pastor Tony here hanging out with you for another Thursday video. And we have a brand new segment coming your way today called Hope Kids Got Talent. Yep, just like America's Got Talent, except we're gonna be showcasing the skills that you guys have within Hope Kids in this video. And so for today, I have my friend Bryce here from Hope Kids. Bryce is a fifth grader and he's gonna be doing some magic tricks for us. Now, this month in, um, in Hope Kids, we've been talking about focus, taking a closer look at what you can see. So I'm gonna be looking closely at his cards because the truth is, is um, back when we were having Hope Kids, Bryce actually did a magic trick on me and it just blew my mind. I had no idea how he did it. So he has three tricks that he's gonna bring in um, my way today. Um, so sit back, relax, try to figure out what Bryce is doing. Focus in on how he does these tricks and see if you can figure it out and see if I can too. Hey, Hope Kids. Uh, so here I am my Star Wars deck. And with this Star Wars deck, I'm gonna blow your mind. So this trick is called the Reunited Sisters, okay? So first, so first I'm gonna take out the deck. Okay. And for this trick, we're going to be using the two black queens, okay? So first I'm actually going to shuffle the deck. All right, do I leave the queens here? Uh, yes. Okay, don't touch the queens. Okay. Okay. And here's what's happening. When these two queens were uh, babies, uh, they were separated. And they were separated from their uh, two sisters, the Queen of Hearts and the Queen of Diamonds, okay? Um, there's a story. And since there's babies, and, and since they were babies, uh, they have no memory of anything. But just a week ago, they figured out that they actually do have two sisters, okay? And I'm gonna have you and me okay. help find them. We're okay. finding the sisters. Yep. Okay. So I'm just going to deal out cards one by one, and okay. I just need you to tell them to stop. Stop at any card? Yep. Okay. So I can say stop. Yep. And then, do you want the queen of spades or the queen of clubs? Uh, let's go with the queen of clubs. Okay. We're going to put this queen of clubs right here on okay. top, and the rest of the deck here. All right. Now we're going to do that same process again, and I need you to tell them to stop. Stop. Okay. Here we go. We'll wait a little bit longer this time around. And stop. Okay, we're gonna put the Queen of Spades okay. here. And the rest so of the Queen, deck of, here. Queen of Spades and Queen of Clubs yep. in your deck cards. Okay. So now I'm gonna just spread the deck. Oh wait, I forgot to tell you. This okay. deck is magical and it influences you to like put the queens anywhere it wants you to. Okay. Okay. Um, and if it got and if the deck got it right, it which actually, it should, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. It actually puts the two queens. Right My next. heart is racing right now. I'm so excited their, for this. Oops, right next Kay. to their two sisters. Stop it. <laughs> How? This is amazing. <laughs> Seriously, this is amazing. <laughs> this trick is called uh, the Impossible Mind Reader. Okay. So first, I'm going to shuffle the deck. Need to give it a quick overhand shuffle. Okay. Okay. And now I'm just going to ripple through the deck. Okay. And I just need you to tell me when to stop okay. anywhere you would like. Stop anytime. Okay. All right. Stop. Okay. Now I'm going to shuffle the deck. Okay. Keeping a closer eye on your hands and the cards. I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, so now uh, I'm gonna show you an example of what you're gonna do. Okay. okay. So you're going to just take any small portion of the deck. Okay. Flip it over and put it back on top. Okay. Okay. So I could do it at any, like with any part of the deck. With any part of the deck. Okay. Yes. I would so rather it be like, like closer to the top. Top area. Yes. So I won't ruin your trick. No. Okay. Because you just need. Is that good? Yep. That's good. And then place it up top like that. Yes. Okay. And now. I need you to do that same process again. Okay. But this time, cut deeper. Okay. So, is this good? Yes. Perfect. And then, do I flip that over? Yes. So now the king of clubs perfect. is up front. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to turn my back. Okay. And I just need you to look through these face-up cards. Okay. And the first face-down card you see is your card. Okay. Okay. Do I keep this card? You look at it. Okay. Just look at it, and then when you memorize it, 
put it back. Face and down? Put it back face down. Okay. And return the deck to its original position. Okay. And then so I just put the ones that are faced up right on top, right? Face down. In its original. In its original position. Okay. okay. So like that? Perfect. Okay. Now, oh wait. No, no. That was a lot of pressure. Let me just flip this part over. Now, um, I'm going to, I, I don't know if you knew this, but me and the cards have a special connection. I didn't know that, but I'm glad, <laughs> um, I'm glad I do now. And we have such a special connection that if I just put my hands over uh, the cards, I could, okay. I could tell you that your card was black. Am I supposed to confirm this? Yes. Yes, it is a black card. Okay. Um, hold on, let me do that again. Okay. Um, I'm I'm hearing that your card is a club. It is a club. Okay. So this part we're gonna do a bit differently. Okay. So I'm going to name every one of the card values. Okay. And if I when I say your card value, just over and over again say it in your mind. So like let's say your card value was a jack. Okay. When I say jack, you would say in your mind jack, jack, okay. jack, jack. Okay. Got it. We're gonna do that. Okay. Ace. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, jack, queen, king. Okay. Are you saying it over and over again? I, I did, yes. Okay, I'm gonna get a little sense of what your card is. Okay. Okay, so I believe your card is out. What the, why are you, why are you yelling at me cards? Sorry, hold on, let me just get a little sense. Oh, okay, so. Actually, their interruption was good because I was about to say your card was the um, nine of clubs. Okay. But they actually corrected me and told me that your card was the six of clubs. How? <laughs> I, how does he know that? How do you know? <laughs> Lie detection, okay? Lie detection, okay. So first I'm going to actually shuffle the deck. Are you gonna make me lie in this one? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> You're gonna make your kid's pastor lie. Um, A little bit? Okay. <laughs> All right. So here's what I need you to do, okay? Okay. I'm just gonna spread through the cards. Okay. And I just need you to stop me by touching any one card. Okay. That, that one? one? Yep. Okay, now please look at it and memorize it. Tell me when you got okay. it. Okay. Don't worry, I did not look. Okay. Look at it and I memorize. Take it? Yep. I'm gonna put it right here in the middle of the deck. Did you look at that? Mm, no. Okay. <laughs> Just want to check. Now I'm going to shuffle the deck so that your card is completely lost in okay. the deck. All right. So I don't know where it's at. All right. So now um, I'm gonna riffle through the cards, and I just need you to tell me when to stop okay. anywhere you would like. Anywhere. Stop. There, okay, we're gonna put this here. Okay. And now, um, we're gonna play a little game called lie detection. Okay. It's when you have to say, I, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna show you a few cards. Okay. And no matter what card it is, say, yes, that's it, okay? Okay. And the cards are going to tell me whether or not you're lying. Okay. okay? So let's begin. Okay. First, is this your card? Yes, it is. No, I don't think so. Is this your card? Yes, it is. No, I don't think so. Is this your card? Yes, it is. Nah. Okay, so now we are done playing the game. Okay. Um, I'm going to show you a few more cards. Okay. And this time, be honest, okay? okay? So, I'm pretty sure this top card here is your card. No, it's not. Here. Okay, the bottom one? Nope. Okay, well, I know that this Jack of Spades isn't your card. Correct. And neither is this Seven of Clubs. Correct. And you're thinking, you're probably thinking this is your card, but it's not. But the top and bottom cards aren't either. Hold on. If I just see this top card or flick, it changes to your card. How? <laughs> Bro, my card. No, give me. This was right here in the middle. I'm sitting here thinking, he ruined this trick. I was thinking, there's no way that we're going to have to redo this because that card was right there. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. <laughs>